Good morning guys and welcome back to my channel today. We're going to the island. guys welcome back before I go any further I want to say thanks to each and every one of you for taking time out of your day to watch my videos I do appreciate that very much uh, if you haven't already done so make sure you uh, hit the red button ring the bell share the video you know what to do anyway today we're talking about Marley coffee Bob Marley's coffee company anyway we're gonna have some interesting facts about Bob Marley coming up here in a second all right guys so I recently come across Marley Coffee at a, at a small cafe in Chatham called Baja Cafe. They get all kinds of different ones. I do have a few different ones that I'm going to have in the future. But today, this is called Lively Up Marley Coffee. It is a dark roast. <laughs> right up my alley. And I also kind of like reggae music. Yeah. And as usual, we're going to try it black, then with milk. In the meantime, I'm going to bring you some interesting facts about Bob Marley. Obviously, I've got it in the pod. I don't have any of the beans. I'm going to try and find some, but for now, it's in the pod. Alright, while that's doing its thing, let's talk about Bob Marley. You okay? I think my Keurig's dying. Keurig, if you're watching, it's on its last leg. Alright, interesting facts about Bob Marley. Bob Marley was born on the 6th of February 1945 and he passed away on the 11th of May 1981. He was a Jamaican reggae singer, which we all pretty much know that. Bob Marley's name was Nesta Robert Marley. Didn't know that either. It says here in his biography that his nickname was White Boy. In his youth, he was a fortune teller. Then went to singing. Obviously, singing was more prosperous. Apparently, Bob Marley spent almost a year in the ghettos of Kingston. Uh, he then returned to his rural village and declared his new destiny to be a singer. He got together with some of his friends and they named their band the Wailing Wailers. Uh, they have their own global brand of marijuana. That goes without saying. In 1966, Bob Marley was having a hard time making a living as a musician despite a few nationally popular SKA hits. He left Jamaica for 10 months and lived with his mother in Wilmington, Delaware. Also worked at a Chrysler automotive plant. This is kind of different here. Uh, no Bob Marley song or album ever won a Grammy. But Bob Marley himself did. Bob Marley was a vegetarian. It says here Bob Marley had 11 kids. Or maybe 13. Okay, so when Bob Marley died, he was buried in a crypt in Nine Mile, St. Anne Parish, Jamaica. Also his childhood home. Uh, he was buried with his Gibson Les Paul guitar, a soccer ball, and a Bible. And a bud of marijuana. On that note, let's try the coffee. Okay, so this is the dark roast coffee called Lively Up. It's definitely dark. That's got a really good bite to it. Really good bite. 
Let's see how the milk does. That's good coffee. That is real good coffee. Marley Coffee's Lively Up. I think you're going to rank in the top 10. I'm not quite sure where to put you yet, but you're going to rank in the top 10. Alright, so this is obviously not a coffee that you're going to want to drink before you go to bed. First thing in the morning, mid-afternoon. Oh yeah, this is good stuff. Marley Coffee's Lively Up. You're a winner. All right, well, there you have it, folks. Lively up. Good coffee. Some interesting facts about Bob Marley. Uh, some I didn't know. Some I kind of had an idea, but some I didn't know. It's interesting nonetheless. Anyway, that's all I got for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed that. And remember, remember, the best way to drink coffee is the way you like to drink it. See you all in the next one. Later.